Okay, so first things first, happy Friday. It is Friday and we have some errands to run today. I have to get my nails done. It's about that time. I also have to get my toes done. We also have to go to Target because I want to get a crock pot. I want to make turkey chili tomorrow. I have tons of turkey meat from uh, Costco. So some turkey chili. So we have to grab that. And we also have to grab the ingredients for the turkey chili as well. I'm going to go into TJ Maxx because yesterday I saw a Marc Jacobs foundation and concealer put together. My car. <laughs> needs a car wash really it is so dirty on the outside um because of the snow and everything like that so it needs a good car wash also going to be doing that i have to run my son's computer to school because he left it in the car this morning i'm gonna go ahead and run that really quickly there get our nails done so let's go hours later I ended up getting my nails done I'm gonna show you guys that really quickly here went into TJ Maxx and I got what I needed plus more I'll show you guys that when I get home it is freezing today it is currently 10 degrees out it is so so cold I didn't want to take you guys into the nail salon because I have taken you guys in there multiple times. There was a weird experience going on in the nail salon today. I have on today for my perfume Baccarat and my nail tech was like, what perfume are you wearing? This is one of the scents that is so intrigued and significant because everywhere you go, everyone wants to know what are you wearing. And it's Baccarat. Smells so good. He had me Google it for him and everything because he's going to buy it. I have my nails here really quickly because we have to head to Target. It is 1221. I actually wanted to get myself some lunch but i don't think i will be able to do that because i have to wait for my son to get off the bus so i don't think we have time for that but we're gonna head to target we're gonna buy everything we need for the chili we just need like the canned beans and that's about it because i have everything else at home but let me show you guys the nails Here we go typical me right just went with white french so cute so polished so put together i love them just love them boys let's go to target it's freezing today I'm thinking about getting these pants. Oh, these are boot cut. I thought they were just... They're $35. I thought they were just um, straight leg, but they're boot cut. Show you guys my outfit really quickly. Here's my OOTD. So cute. Mies loves Minnie Mouse and it's her birthday. So I have to get her a birthday gift. So how cute are these pajamas? Super cute. And then they have the robe. <laughs> this is just so cute. I'm going to see if I can find her like a Minnie Mouse toy. I also found this backpack, but I'm not too sure about it. I don't know. I just don't like the reflective. And then, how cute is this? She's so cute, this little dress. I like this one. 
so cute. But I'm not too sure about that backpack. I'm gonna have to see. This is what they have for Minnie Mouse. They don't have a lot. Their section is uh, minimal, but I did end up finding her this. So I think we're just gonna go with this. Super cute. With her like pajamas and stuff. You guys know I have been mentioning that I need a runner for my room. This is actually um, the runner for my living room rug and it's only $45. I think I'm just going to end up getting this one because at this point I haven't found one that I really like. I was going to Amazon one but it sold out so I think I'm just going to get this one and just put it in my... um my bedroom I mean in my closet at this point so I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna end up getting the runner and putting it in my closet and this one's 28 by 40 by no 28 by 84 I'm back home not for long though because I have to pick up my children from school and bus stops and all of that. I ended up buying myself some lunch from Panera because I am starving and I haven't had anything to eat today besides a matcha latte this morning. Got myself some lunch. I'm gonna go ahead and eat that. Got myself a tomato soup with bread and I got a salad. This is the Thai chicken salad. I think it's new because i've never seen it before so i wanted to try it and i got myself a green tea and this is all from panera i just finished eating my food from panera and let me tell you guys that salad amazing i think it's called the thai citrus chicken salad go try it it is so good it is one of my favorites now from panera it is amazing so so good i want more but that was enough for me share with you guys what i ended up getting from a tj Maxx. got a whole bunch of like cosmetics things things first i got some moisturizer and though i bought some moisturizer last week from ocean state i ended up finding this nars moisturizer and i couldn't pass it up the nars skin luminous moisture cream i'll take it out the packaging to show you guys it looks and it was $24.99 I don't know if they still have this on the Sephora site I might check for you guys but how sleek and pretty is the packaging I'm gonna open it up and here's how it looks it smells good too it smells nice and clean I'm going to start trying this out and I will let you guys know if it's any good. But I'm sure you can find it at Sephora still. Let me see. I'm going to check for you guys really quickly. Okay. So they have it at Bloomingdale's for $64. I think you guys can see this, but... 64 at Bloomingdale's and I found it for $24.99. They also have it at Neiman Marcus for $64. And that's about it. Let's see if they have it on Sephora site. Not see it on the Sephora site, but they do have it at Bloomingdale's, Neiman Market. This was a steal. I'm so excited and happy I found it. Can't wait to use it. I love, love the packaging on that. I was at TJ Maxx yesterday. I saw this in there, but I was like, let me wait it out and see. And if I keep thinking about it, then I'm going to go back for it. This is the Marc Jacobs Cafe Powder Brush Bronzer and Highlight Palette. And this was only $19.99. Let me show you guys how it looks. Look at the packaging. 
oh my gosh the packaging is so pretty on this thing so so pretty and sleek and just ah uh, okay so it comes with a bronzer i'm gonna try this bronzer on it might be fine I think it might be fine. I'm going to try it out and see and I'll let you guys know if it was any good. The bronzer as the blush also and the highlight. And I love the blush. And the highlight. Okay. Okay. Well, my hand is shimmering. So yeah, this was $19.99 from Marc Jacobs. Next up, we have a lip pencil, and this is from Becca in the color Chill. And this was only $5. And I love my brown lip liners. I love them. This is how it looks. Ugh, I'm going to love this. This is so creamy and smooth and just glides on so easily. Love lining my lips with a brown liner. Then going in with my lipstick, kind of doing like an ombre effect. I love that. This is in the color Chill. And it was only $4.99. So grab this foundation from Marc Jacobs as well. And this was $12.99. $12.99. It's actually a foundation and concealer put together, it says. Caffeine concealer and foundation. Mm. Let's see how it looks. From the same collection as this one. So, let's see. And this was $12.99, if I haven't said it already. And looks. This one is in the color tan. Let me show you guys. I think this is going to be perfect for my skin. Because this is the color of my concealer in Fawn. So I think this is going to be perfect. I can't wait to try it out. I'm going to try that out tomorrow. Let's see. Yeah. I think this is going to be perfect for my skin so that's that for Marc Jacobs um, Bare Minerals I ended up finding this plumping lip gloss Laura knows that I need a good lip gloss my lips go through it in the winter time this was only $5.99 I'm gonna put it on right now actually because I have nothing on oh I don't like the color wait I don't like colors like this because they don't look good on my skin. I don't know. Let me try it out. Should I try it out? Or should I return it? I don't know. Well, it was only it was only $5.99. So let's try it out. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so not bad. Thought the color would have shown a little bit more, but it doesn't. So I'm liking it. It is tingly a little bit. And it tastes like mint. So I like it. Okay, okay. So we're not returning it. We're keeping it. The last thing we ended up getting was a lipstick. And this is actually from MAC. And it's in the color Ruby Woo. This lipstick first came out like years ago, years ago. I think it was because of Rihanna. So was it because of Rihanna? I think it was because of Rihanna that this lipstick came out because she was wearing it or something like that. It was her like signature lipstick. I don't know. Might be making it up. <laughs> don't quote me on that. But when it did came out, I had one. I remember having one. And then I declutter all of my makeup and I ended up getting rid of it. I don't know why because it's such a beautiful red. It's such a beautiful color. So I ended up buying it again and I'm so happy and glad that I did because like I said it's such a beautiful red color especially for now like the winter time. If you want to add like a pop of color to your lips 
beautiful beautiful so i'm so glad that i ended up getting this and finding it and it was only 7.99 at uh, TJ Maxx. So that is all for our makeup purchases. I'm gonna let you guys know how I feel about a few products that are in here like the moisturizer and the blush palette and also the foundation. And I do try it out. It is now 2.46 so I have to go pick up my son at the bus stop. I think I'm gonna do is that I left everything from Target in the car so I have to show you guys that later on when I come back. Did you miss me? Mm -hmm. I ate a hamburger. I ate a hamburger with um chicken, but I didn't like the hamburger. So when I ate the orange, the mustard again, yes. But do we have orange at home? Because I know. Yes, we do. Remember, I told you we had some in the fridge yesterday. Yeah, and yeah. then when I ate that um that that um milk cereal, and then I just ate the yogurt too, yeah. and then like. Managed to get everything out of the car, but I dropped everything. I dropped the crock pot, I dropped the runner, <laughs> I dropped the other piece that I'm gonna show you guys right now, but I ended up buying the crock pot, I'll be unboxing it really soon. I wanna see how it looks. I wanna put it together because I told you guys that I wanna make chili tomorrow. So I'm gonna be opening it. It was only $19.99 on sale plus tax, probably like $21 all together this is the one that i ended up getting it's the four quarts they had a smaller one for 15 and this feeds about five people also ended up getting this shelf i have some in my closet and they like hold my shoes but i'm going to be putting my printer here i'm going to show you guys where my printer is I'm going to be putting my printer here and organizing everything because everything is pretty much on the floor. So that's what I'm going to be doing with that. Um, we're going to build it together. It's super easy to build. I have built the ones that I already have in my closet and this is 31 inches. And this shelf was $17. This is the area that I told you guys that I will be organizing because it's literally a mess. My printer is on the floor. This is my computer area. My Apple Watch is on the floor. So I'm going to be building the shelf, putting it under here, and then I'm going to put my printer and everything else that I store down here. I usually have my Apple Watch charging down here that's why it's on the floor but we're gonna build the shelf and we're gonna organize this area because yeah it's a mess lots of cords lots of things going on down here here's our progress so much better so so much better we have our printer my watch my extra batteries for my camera my tripods some of them because I have like five tripods I just feel so good about this. Let me back up a little bit. Just so good because everything is organized. Well, floor and I am not annoyed by the fact that things are on the floor. Super happy and super excited about it. Mm -hmm. 